what is good guys so I totally forgot when you exit whenever you're at risky comes out risky boots she's here I had a feeling you'd show up I'm afraid my patience for you is starting to wear thin why don't you hand over both magic seals now and save your dear uncle from any further unpleasantries never fine we'll do this the hard way you'll both beg for my mercy in the end you'll see Yes. All right. So now we need to go ahead and save right here. And once we do that, we can go back to Scuttletown and go use the force key. Out. Whoa. That was a big hit. That was not very nice. Pike bomb of the truck. I just beat a whole temple full of these things. They should be nothing to me. That was a huge truck that just went by. I hope you guys didn't hear that. And I'm dead. Ah! Yep, that's my death every time. It makes for good, good shows. Good episodes whenever I die. Just like the last one where I just freaking died. There we go. Get all the healing potions in. Monkey it up. That way I can actually get some good jump distance. Yeet. I gotta stop eating. I don't want to edit into. I'm not gonna edit that one in, but all the other ones I think I edited in the all my eats. All my eats inside the meats. Go through this one. I believe this is Barracuda. Uh, I'm sorry, Ammo Baron's place. I think it is or not. No, this place is different. There we go. Um, I believe this is also where a sacred treasure is. Ah! I've been stabbed. Do do. Go this way. Oh, here's a warp squid. We actually need to get this. I'm actually glad we did that. Yes, it is morning. All right, warp squid. I would like to go to Lilac Field, please. Yes. So we don't even need to go to Scuttletown. We can just go straight to uh, where the forest key is. This is the good stuff right here. I may need to go back and find the elephant transformation, but I have no idea where that is. So we're going to be stuck for a bit. But it's okay! Because right now I just need to show you guys where we use the forest key. Remember that little hole? Hang in the hole. Boom. That's right over here. Right to you. This is where we use it. Go ahead and use the forest key. Now we can get in there. So now we can do that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're also supposed to have uh, the. No, we're not supposed to have the elephant just yet. I think it may be here. And the mermaid is somewhere else, I believe. Yeah, the mermaid is under, literally, quite literally underwater. I think maybe no, it's not underwater. It's it's somewhere. It, it, we're gonna find everything somewhere. Okay, go ahead and use this. Oh dang, look at all these crabbies. Alright, let's see. Okay. Go ahead and go through here. And here it is! Alright, so I was just confused of where the elephant was. Who approaches my fountain, magic fountain thingy place thing? Beautiful. I sense a restless energy deep inside you. Channel your passions and allow that magic to take shape. Synchro Shokan! <laughs> Elephant dance. 
That's whenever, whenever I think of like something taking shape, like they always say these things in Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds when they synchro summon, like allowing something to something and then boom, synchro Shokan. Okay, so now what you do is you hold the dance button until you see that and then Shantae becomes an elephant. There's that. Okay. Boom. This big this big girl right there. Alright. So now that we got the elephant, we can go back to the front of the um of the place. There's that. Super simple and easy. Alright, just get rid of all those things that we had to worry about. Now we don't have to. We can just go straight here now. And I don't believe we have, we don't have to worry about the crabs. Once we kill them, they're dead. Okay, now we can go straight through here. Oh wait, hold on. Okay, so this is what you're supposed to do. Go up here, 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 here. There we go. You gotta time it just right though, so you gotta be at like right the, at the right angle so that you can Shantae hammer that through. Wait, is there no more to this dungeon? Is it just so we can get the uh... Is it just so we can get the uh, what do you call it? The transformation? I think so! Huh! Neat! Very neat. Okay, so let's go back. I thought there were more. I thought there was more to this place, and I keep saying I played this before. Like you know what? It's been like a solid week and a half since I finished this game. Not even actually. It's probably been like five days since I last finished this game, because I was still playing it while I was doing the let's play. So uh, I was like, okay, I know where to go. No, I don't know where to go. I'm gonna like read the whole game facts article. There it is. I gotta see Abner and Poe. Hey, you brainiac. Where are you going? Yes, where to? Who are you guys? No need for alarm, Shantae, right? No need for alarm. Shantae, right? That's how you're supposed to read it. The chick with the brain? <laughs> From Scuttletown? Yeah, she's the one little sis is always running at the mouth about. You guys are Roddy's bro Roddy Top's brothers? Yeah, that's right. Abner Cadaver? Cadaver. The oldest. And this here's Poe. We're here to because we got a proposition for you. Like? Like, we know your next stop is the Hypno Baron. This, his oceanic fortress is impenetrable. There ain't no way you're breaking in there without our help. It's a labyrinth that bores deep into the seaside cliffs. It sides, it's filled with tricks and traps. Very, very dangerous. Our offer is this. We get you in, in return, you gotta brew us some coffee. Are you serious? Dead serious. You know about wild brain eating zombies? A strong cup of joe is the only thing that separates us from them. So do it. You don't want to be there when sis eyes rolls back and she goes freak show on you. That's funny. You're going to need a coffee machine and some French and some fresh coffee beans. And I'll like mine with a rotten egg mixed in. Full circle with that rotten egg. Drop it off at the old boathouse and we'll hook up with you. Hook you up with the way into that labyrinth. You got all that? I hear you, but seriously, I have to do a coffee run? You ain't gotta do it, but good luck get inside the Hypno Baron's digs if you don't. Okay. The plot thickens, so I did know what to do, sort of, kind of. There is something we gotta do here. So let's go ahead and do it. So now that we have the elephant, we're now able to run past a few things. A few obstacles we weren't able to before. That's the warp squid. I remember from doing this multiple times. <laughs> what everything is. Alright, go to the back. And then we're gonna go a little elephant dance right here. Just burst right through them. 
Alright, whoop, yikes. That was actually really close. Why are there so many of them? There you go. Go ahead and do this. Oh, I need the monkey ability before I can even attempt to do this. I think. I think so, yeah. Hold on. Jeez, I hate the smog. The smog scarecrows are even worse than the regular scarecrows. Oh wait, hold on. I didn't mean to do that, but you know what? That was actually kind of perfect. I didn't mean to monkey dance, but I did. But I did! Ow. Oh shoot. I just keep, you know, hitting everything that doesn't need to get hit. Okay, now we got a coffee machine. Okay, you know what? Potion time, because I don't want to die like we did last time and have to redo this entire episode. There's that. Alright, now that we got that. I can't remember where the beans are though. Where the hell are the beans? Okay. There's that now. I think I actually have to go further in here. freaking spiders all right guys that's gonna be it for this episode next episode we're gonna go ahead and find the beans and we're gonna get the rotten egg thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys next time